What's going on guys? You know who it is, Ali here, back with another video. And in today's video, I wanna talk about self-judgment, right? How to stop judging yourself. Now, this is something that I've fallen into, the, into in the past, and uh, every once in a while, I fall into two. But I figured out some things that have helped me to stop judging myself, right? So, what are, what are those things? And the first thing I would say to stop judging yourself, which is on the other side of it, is self-acceptance, right? Self-love. And that is something that's very important and rarely talked about in our society. Uh, our society wants us to make us feel that we're not good enough so we can stay stuck in the consumer culture and you can fall into the pattern of constantly judging yourself and feeling that you're not good enough but if you accept yourself and love yourself for who you are then you don't need any of the products you don't feel like you're missing anything Right? and realize that you can be a masterpiece and a work in progress at the same time. You, don't, you can feel good about yourself and still try, uh, strive for something more. So that's number one is self-acceptance, self-love. Number two I would say is uh, look at everything as a lesson right when you look at everything in your uh, happening in your life as a lesson and you see it as an investment in your future then you can look at it objectively and just take the lesson rather than looking at it uh, as oh I'm not good enough and then uh, well it's okay of course you're not you're not good enough you don't have experience yet and everything that you're going through uh, 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 in your life right now is experience, is lessons. Try to get the lessons out of everything that you're going through. No matter where you are in life, if you have that approach, you can be $100,000 in debt. But if you have the approach that whatever I am going through right now, it is just an investment. It is just lessons for the future right because success is something you attract by the person you become so you need to become that person by learning those lessons that you're going through right now like I said earlier you can be a masterpiece and they work in progress at the same time so look for the lessons in everything and try to get sense of reality the more you have of that the more grounded you'll feel the calmer you'll feel the more you'll feel that you know what I can tackle whatever life brings my way you know I, I uh, read the book the 50th law and uh, 50 cents said uh, reality is my drug the more I have of it the more power I feel and the higher I feel by looking at uh, 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 for everything as lessons, you tend to have a better sense of reality. And like 50 Cent, you'll have uh, a, a, a more sense of power. You'll feel empowered and you'll feel high off of that drug, which is reality. The third thing I'm going to say, which is some of you might already know what I'm going to say, is meditation right how does meditation help you from not judging yourself well meditation quiets down the mind if you sit for 20 minutes and you just say okay I'm gonna focus on just my breath in and out 
or I'm gonna focus on a mantra. Ram, Ram, Ram. And have that single minded focus. What happens is the voice in your head, the judgment voice, which is I call the inner whiny bitch, the inner, the lower self, all that voice is, you start to notice it. It creeps in. But when it creeps in, you just observe it as if it's a cloud like above me here as if it's a cloud passing by and when uh, you just observe it that way it just passes by you don't give that voice power right and then you can quiet down the mind and be calm anyways that's it for today's video guys to recap self-acceptance Accept where you are, you can be a masterpiece and a work in progress at the same time. Look for the lesson in everything. And third and foremost is meditation. Hope you guys found this video helpful. If so, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't done so already, please hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.